All right, so now let's play the new hero, Tracer. So as you can see, she's pretty cool, pretty quick. Has her own little perky little dancers. And uh, looks like the other team has Trump on their team. Anyway, so my first build, I'm going to... Wait. That pose! <sighs> anyway, where was he? So. Oh, that's cool. She sits in a little lion. Alright, so the enemy team has Murky and Jaina, so I want to go against them, so I'll let them know that. And that's because I don't want to go against Reyna. Trace is pretty good against anyone that has targeted damage, and anyone that she can kite. So Murky's a great target, until he gets Octa Grab, at least. Uh, let's see, for my first talent... Oh, no! Uh, I never get Trace arounds. That was a very big mistake. I should have got the uh, Slipstream ability. That is much better. That was a very big mistake. Hopefully it won't ruin this game. But let's go on against Jaina. So if, as long as I can dodge her... Frost abilities, I'll be fine. It looks like I've got a healer, which is nice. So Trace's special ability is, of course, that she can move while attacking, which is pretty good. So it's great for kiting. She's a bit low on HP, maybe the same as, uh, I guess, Vala. So I'm just going to try and uh, avoid all of those attacks. So her three abilities, you'll see uh, she has Blink. She's got a melee attack and her recall ability, which will send her back in time. And also she gets her uh, ultimate ability from level 1, and then at 10 you can choose different upgrades. So I'm going to go in. Oh, my ultimate's already ready. Maybe I can get... Mm, no, not next to those towers. So a good move I want to do is I want to uh, blink in, use my bomb, and then uh, recall out. Might be a bit tricky though, next to their towers. Looks like the Butcher's doing okay. He might need some help. I think Muradin should probably go up and try and deal with him. Jaina's so close to dying. If I can just trick her into coming a little bit closer, I can get her. Come on, Jaina. Come on, Jaina. Come on. A little bit closer. Alright, let's go for it. Bomber. Alright, recall. Yeah, anyway, so I got it. <laughs> ah, that's alright, Lurin. Don't worry. You get shots later. So it's not too bad going against Johanna. Uh, you have, of course have to be careful of her blind. Trace is very vulnerable to blind, so Lily's actually a pretty good counter. And uh, of course, Johanna also has her own blind. Oh, a bit of lag there. Alright, so our next talent I'm going to get Untouchable. I'm getting this for a specific reason, that uh, they've got Merc in their team. So every time I get a kill, it'll increase my melee damage by about 2%, I think. And with all more kills I get then I'll get more damage. Of course, if I die, I lose everything. So as long as I can stay alive, which Tracer is pretty good at, I'll be fine. And it looks like we have a little bit of advantage at the beginning of the game, thanks to those early kills. One of the things is that Tracer is a lot like a female Illidan. Uh, so, well, please don't start shipping female your, your female Illidan fanfics on me. But by, by that I mean that you can't really get away from Illidan, and you can't really get away from Tracer if they don't want them to get away. Got all the seeds we need, probably. Uh, and a couple more. So we go down south. Now, Murky is actually so bad against Tracer. You can get some Octograbs, which is pretty lucky, but basically all of Murky's abilities don't really work, and because Pufferfish only takes three shots to be destroyed, Tracer can easily destroy it. Uh, it looks like he bubbled my bomb. Oh, well, that's a shame. Should get maybe two kills here. Just have to be careful. Oh, nice. That was really good. See if we can get Lily here. So Lily's blinds, you can see, doing a lot of disruption on my abilities. I probably could have got her if I had some blink charges there, but my slip recall wasn't ready, so it's a bit risky. Uh, you can do some pretty fun moves with Tracer as long as you be careful. I must be on my rich love. <laughs> Tracer's the British voice is not the best as well. I have a few real British friends who always don't like her sound. Of course, Americans seem to really love her Tracer. Should be able to get a kill. There we go. Oops, looks like Rain is coming in. So Rain is actually pretty good against Tracer. Of course he does have his skill shot, but his auto attack and range really is difficult to deal with. That's a pretty expensive master skin suit Trump has there as well. Um, so close. Level 7. So I should get my talent, but just have to try and... Hmm, can't really save Morales here. Alright, I'm going to get... Uh, so now when I use my recall ability, I'll have a couple of... Uh, charges a blink, so I can usually get away or use that to engage more. <laughs> I'm really beat up about that stupid first pick on the talent, actually. Um, 
Oh man, it's so bad. It's so very bad. Let's see if we can go get murky. Enough of your my rubbish, love. Ah, it's good, it's minion wave. Not too good at cleaning minion waves, actually. Uh, there is some abilities you can get to make that easier, but not quite at the early levels. Uh, of course, as I said, this one I got untouchable, because I think I'm not going to die very much, if at all. Uh, but in other cases where you think you're going to die a lot, if they've got a lot of direct damage attacks, uh, maybe Calphus, or who else? Maybe Lunara is pretty good. I haven't really fought a Lunara yet. Uh, you might want to get something else, like Parting Gift, so you leave bombs when you use your... Uh, is your recall. Just because you're going to die a few times, you're going to lose all your stacks and it's not going to equal a lot of damage. I actually prefer Untouchable if I can take it though, because I don't use my recall as much. It's like maybe about 20 seconds you can use it, so I'd rather have the damage all the time. A bit tricky here. Of course my bomb's ready, so if I could get in and maybe... Ah, so close. Well, I guess I got Jaina with that anyway. You see, that's what uh, Tracer in Overwatch and also in Heroes of the Storm is really good at going into the back line and then just taking people out. And if people ignore you, that's the best thing to happen. So as you can see that Johanna isn't really dealing with me and I have the ability to blink in the back and take out their squishies. Although I'm quite squishy myself, but I do have a good healer. Alright, so now for my last... Well, I guess not my last, but for this upgrade, this will increase the range of my pulse bomb so I can lob it a bit farther. And also, I can charge it faster on my auto attacks, as long as it's versus heroes. It's worth noting that her punch... Ooh, stim pack. I don't know if it's really good on Tracer because she's limited by her... Ooh, I might get out. Ooh, woohoo! Oh, I just got out of that. <laughs> nice. Oh dear, I could take out these mercenaries. Thought I was done for there. Didn't want to lose my stacks though, so... Yeah, the stim, I'm not sure it's the best on Tracer because she's already pretty quick, so the movement buff isn't that much, and her attacks are limited by her reload. So, ooh, you survived? Yeah, I did. Thanks to the timey-wimey stuff. Timey-wike, timey-wimey recall. You know, you know what I mean. Let me just tell these guys. Timey-wimey. There we go, stuff. Oh, we got reverse 911, so it's not Illuminati, Illuminati confirmed yet. It's almost 711 too. Okay, so we have this. Hmm, where should I go? I need to charge my bomb up, actually. It's good to use your melee hit uh, to charge that. So you get 10% on heroes and 5% on regular ones. It is time. Do what must be done. <laughs> I'm not sure if Trace is OP, actually. She seems pretty good, but I'm not sure. Like, she seems fairly well countered by Reyna, if Reyna's playing very well. She's a lot of fun, though. She's definitely a very fun hero. I'm not sure about OP, though. I really should have taken out the pufferfish, actually. Yeah. Hmm, gonna stay away from that Fallen Sword. That's better. I think that's a much better choice to put the stim pack onto the Butcher. Butcher's great for that, of course. Could take out that pufferfish again, but a bit risky. One thing you're just gonna be careful of when you play here is that sometimes your auto attack will turn off, so you might have to A-move. That's pretty easy, I mean. You can also choose which targets you want to fire at while you're running, if you are good enough at clicking on people, which isn't that difficult. So she's listed as a hard hero, but I don't really think that. I mean, she's good, and definitely a good tracer is a very good tracer. But I think that if you're an average player, tracer is not too difficult. Of course, only the people that have pre-ordered Overwatch get a player at the moment, but I think on Tuesday you can buy her for 1500 gold. Not 1,500, what am I talking about? 15,000 gold. Ooh, here we go, Lily. Ah, keep, Johanna keeps absorbing my bombs. I guess that's my fault, though. I'm gonna take out Murky here. Ooh, missed that. And let's take out that Pufferfish. And actually, can we get Jaina? Hmm, if my bomb was ready, maybe. I guess I'll go after Lily. What's that, Jon Snow? I see you looking at me, Flaps. Stupid voice, honestly. Oh, we can get Jaina here. Ooh, dodge that. Come on, just... Yeah, nice. I almost think that Lambs of the Slaughter would have been better for the Butcher in that one. I'll probably get these Giants, actually. So the Giants... Mercy, ooh, nice. The Mercenaries always dispawn when you uh, summon, like, Garden Terrors and things like that, but if you engage them before that happens, you can still take them. So we can get these, but you notice that all the other Mercenaries are off the map, so it's a great time to pick them up. Thankfully, Moradin uh, helped me get those. Let's see. 
Where's Murky off to? He's down. Is he killing Morales? I need to hit this fountain first. Uh, then we can go after Reyna. Okay, so the talent I got was Rick. Ooh, look at that damage. I'm like, looks like 30% higher than the next damage uh, king, which is Reyna, which is kind of strange. I guess he's on the losing team. The losing team always has a little bit less damage, of course. What's wrong with Trump? It's a good question. He's going to make America great again. Ah, uh, so let's see. 10 minutes in. This is a really quick game. Unfortunately, Trump isn't making his team great again. They're doing quite poorly under his leadership. Actually, was he the... I don't think he was their, their team pick. I was my team's pick. So I was their... The person that gets the team pick in Hero League is the one with the highest MMR or matchmaking uh, rating. So let's go help out. Maybe we can get Jaina here if we're careful. I just need a blink in there and hit it with a bomb. Come on, come on, come on. Ah, just out of range. I'll recall out of there. That would have been so good. Oh, so I should have kept my bomb for the... Uh, Nidus Moor, or whatever it is called. Devouring Moor. It's not a Nidus. But... Nidus is the other one. Oh, oh, oh. Get some kills here, maybe. Mm, not quite. Need that bomb to charge faster. Should be able to kill Murky. Just need to wait till that runs out. There we go. It's a nice uh, suit, actually. From I haven't seen many people with the Reyna uh, Master skin. It's quite nice, though. It's very similar to the the original, but a little bit different. And we are dominating this game. We are almost three levels up, and we're only 11 minutes in. This is going to probably be like a 15 minute game. I don't know, maybe 15, 16 minutes. They can make a comeback. And then I'm still being haunted by that bad pick. Also, you can charge your bomb on these walls, so you should uh, be just mindful of that. I'm going to hit this a few times. And I'm going to get sleight of hand. So that's a 20% DPS increase. It's going to work nicely with Untouchable. Of course, you can get more DPS from the reload ability, but you have to be pretty good to do that. And I think that, like, in a team fight, you're too busy worrying about other things. So I'm just going to get the 20%. It's only a 15% uh, difference, really. I mean, it would be nice if you were perfect, but none of us... Well, I'm not perfect. I'm pretty bad. Oh, yeah, Stimpak. Let's go. Let's see if we can get Jaina. Get her with the bomb. Hit her a few times. Yeah. Thank you, Morales. I think, with actually, with the sleight of hand reload thing, maybe Stim isn't too bad on her. Although, not as good, obviously, as on the Butcher, since he just does the monster of melee attacks. So we can take out... We may be in the game here, actually. Mm, probably not going to have... No, we got one minute left in this Terra, so... Yeah, we could take out maybe two forts. Two, three forts, if we're really lucky. It's funny because a lot of people don't seem to notice that the forts have changed in such a way that uh, on Gun of Terror, that the plant doesn't actually do damage to them now, it only disables them. So some people still try and do the drop- oh! I don't know if you noticed that, but I actually blinked inside the Ring of Frost so I didn't get hit by it. Because if I got hit by the Ring of Frost and the Blizzard, I would have been fully dead. So that was a- I could have blinked out probably, but I didn't want to risk it. So going into the middle wasn't too bad. <laughs> Looks like this game is going to be over in a second. Let's hit them with the bomb. We're going to get triple kill. Nice. Wow, this is, the, this is actually probably one of the better games I've had at Tracer. It'd be a nice game to show people, I guess. Ah. There we go. Game over. GG. GG. Well played, my friends. This is a pretty good, nice team. It's not how you spell Trump, but GG Trump. GG. Well played. Maybe next game friend. So let's just have a look at those stats. Let's see. Well, I got a lot of points from this game. Thank you. 167 points. Nice. Alright, stats. So it looks like I was about 10,000 above Zagara and almost twice their Jaina. So yeah, she's, they only got one kill. Jesus. Uh, I guess they were the ones that would trigger that game. Anyway, Trace a lot of fun. If you want to uh, play here, I definitely recommend it. Just watch out for that triggering if you can handle it of course you can subscribe if you want to see more heroes of the storm and other games and uh thanks for watching see ya